hello and welcome everyone to another analytics uh, tutorial so we have uh, already seen about the uh, references uh, abstract section uh, keyword subsections etc so now uh, we will look about the pictures uh, which uh, is a very important thing to a research paper you can see in our sample research paper in word file there are lots of pictures so we can uh, organize these pictures or figures or images whatever you like to say in a uh, in a very structured and nice way in a latex file and that will be automatically uh, situated in our latex file so uh, let's work with that and you can say in our word file this is not uh, so uh, very much organized uh, so if we want to add these uh, pictures in a latex file at first you need to uh, make all the pictures file uh, or images uh, to separate png file or pdf file or jpg file we can include the png jpg and uh, a pdf file also also uh, all the types of uh, uh, picture format in our uh, latex format so at first i have downloaded all the pictures uh, or uh, i i have uh, uh, arranged all the pictures in a folder and now i will upload those so uh, i am going to my upload option of uh, my overleaf then uh, i will upload all the pictures uh, in uh, this overleaf file so i have arranged all the pictures in this folder and and just drag and drop it and all the pictures will be uploaded here so okay so the pictures is uh, uploaded now we need to uh, situate these pictures in our latex file so for this we need to add some uh, command to add images so uh, let's add so uh, before that i think some subsections are missing in my paper so at first i'm adding those uh, methodology is the section and under i will add this subsection then i will add the pictures so i have copied it and uh, okay so here is methodology let's write subsection and okay i am uh, adding the things i need to add this paper uh, okay now i can add the picture of uh, under this uh, subsection sub subsection actually so uh, whatever i need to write here and we can also give uh, reference of uh, figure like uh, before uh, slash reference and uh, figure name so to start a figure we uh, can write slash begin figure and slash end figure and here we need to uh, write something uh, which one is the uh, figures uh, actually the attributes of uh, figures like uh, uh, do you want to insert in center or what is the name of the graph uh, graphics item and what is uh, the length and width of it uh, let's uh, show me a um, example from a previous file uh, it's loading you can also give level to a picture and you can mention the reference of that level of the picture so a as uh, i use this type of things uh, let's copy it and i am explain i will explain it here uh, okay so you can see here the HTBP is written here which means the uh, picture will be situated just here uh, after the writing otherwise it may float to other where 
and we can also give a uh, caption and uh, in this uh, in here include graphics we can write uh, which picture we uh, need to insert here i think we will insert figure one uh, so i will write that and also i will give a caption and level so i want to insert uh, maybe figure one dot png this picture so we can uh, the main file is uh, dot text file so this one is the main file okay uh, so in include graphics uh, uh, in uh, our uh, f figure field in include graphics here you can say uh, dot png here we can write flowchart dot one which i want to insert here so i am inserting flowchart one dot png and we can mention whatever the uh, width of this uh, picture here we want to show it uh, how much uh, centimeter we want to give the width uh, you can change it and we can give a uh, we must need to give a uh, caption of the figure so i am giving a caption and we can also give a level so the level will uh, uh, cite this picture or we can mention which picture or which figure we are uh, using or we are uh, talking about so you can see this one has 5.5 centimeter and the picture is uh, not so big i think i may uh, make it bigger i am giving 7 centimeter so uh, okay now this one is looking good uh, so uh, you can see in the pdf file the picture has come in methodology section uh, whatever i want to give here and the caption is under the picture and the picture is uh, showing very nicely so uh, and uh, here you can see figure number uh, i have mentioned also and uh, so uh, with this tool we can add figures in our uh, latex file so now here it is uh, algorithm is situated in our uh, sample paper we may insert this algorithm in our latex uh, actually latex have uh, a very nice way to represent uh, complex algorithms uh, this paper is not having so complex algorithm this is just a step and we just uh, add these steps as a line by line or bold formatting or uh, list uh, making uh, steps uh, so uh, i am not inserting any algorithm i think i may make another tutorial only for algorithm in future uh, we can we can represent very nice algorithms in a uh, very efficient way in latex uh, maybe i will show that in uh, future tutorials so i'm just uh, rearranging the lines and we may uh, use the uh, font um, font uh, text format or uh, new lines here uh, let's uh, if we just write here and compile it it will not be represented in a nice way it will be just a paragraph so you can say uh, this is just a paragraph here so we may use uh, new lines as i have seen in previous uh, some tutorials that if we uh, press double slash it will make new lines so we need to make new lines here uh, you can say uh, see this is just a, a paragraph like uh, thing so we need to uh, add new lines and we can also uh, make this step one step two as bold formatted so uh, at first time giving double slash it will make in new lines and we may make this step one as uh, bold to make bold format we may uh, use text bf tex bf and a within this bracket whatever you will write it will be bold format so 
uh, I am copying it and inserting it. Uh, so it will be bold, hopefully. Uh, let's make in some other lines. So I am giving it uh, another one. Okay, now I am compiling it and okay so you can see the step one step two step three is nicely presented and the uh, uh, step one two three is written in bold format so you can uh, nicely present your uh, works here so i'm just doing some other things to present it in a good way okay so okay uh, the figure inserting is done. We have uh, seen how to make new lines, how to make uh, bold format and how to insert figure and uh, cite them. If you want to make it uh, italic format, you can also write just text it. Uh, uh, as you have write text BF, you can write text it and it will be uh, make a italic format. I am not showing it here so now we can uh, we can know how to insert several tables and equations in a latex format and uh, we will see in our uh, next video how to insert next videos how to insert equations and uh, tables and other things in latex format so hopefully we'll see that uh, so thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel and keep sharing and liking my videos thank you